Hi everybody. I've got a another video. I'm going to break it up uh, into two parts here. Um, it's just a mini haul of sorts from different places that um, I went in between uh, my doctor visits that I've been having to go to like three times a week. Um, they do a, a test or a treatment and then I have to go back and they have to check things out. So I have uh, sometimes an hour to two to kill and it doesn't really pay to get go home because I'm usually tired in between and I probably fall asleep and wouldn't, you know, make it back. So I got nail polishes and the other one I'll do and, and I thought, well, you know, instead of doing just one, I go ahead and do it in, in two. Give me something else to do. So um, I'll just pick up the thing and then I'll just tell you where I got it from. I got some little bit of makeup and uh, some other whatnots, but uh, I'll get started. Um, eyelash, eyelash, <laughs> eyeglass case for sunglasses. Yes, mommy's making a video. I know. Shame on her. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I got two of them. It's like the um, snake skin, but it's uh, it's smooth on top. It, just the side isn't. Um, it's purple and silver. I don't know if it's yeah. I'm just picking it up. Um, I got them at Walmart. They were originally five. I got them for uh, two, which um, I got them to put my uh, the new sunglasses that I got from uh, Shop Miss A. I just got one is going to get the one and I thought well uh, I'm having to keep him on my dresser because I don't want him to get st uh, broken I got one in the car then I bring it in and I thought well this way I don't have to worry about it getting broken because I don't have any th this size um, my other one sunglasses were prescription so you know they just fit in an eyeglass case so I got two just like this and for two bucks I they were normally five five or six so I thought that was a a good deal I got two of those um, I had gotten one to make sure it fit and then I went back and had gotten the other one the next time um, and then I had went to um, uh, fam family dollar this is where I got this one. It's the Sally Hansen Salon Effects. Um, as you see, the price was five. I paid a dollar fifty, and I'll take it out and show you because you can't see the color. And it's six forty, and it says Metalhead, but it is so pretty. It's a pretty gray. Um, it almost looks like a purple when um, the light hits it, and you're just not going to see the true color. But I do like these. Um, some of the ones that are um, like just the tips, you can with other designs. But I like putting gems and stuff on them too. But you're not getting a true effect of that. But it's such a pretty. It's I swear it looks like it's a purple tint. But um, you know, a dollar fifty I thought was a good deal on those. Um, And then while I was also there, Esmeralda's channel, um, Esmerhacha, if I'm saying that right, I, I think she needs to repeat it in one of her videos so I can uh, say it right if that's not it. Um, she had talked about the, this palette she had gotten, uh, the Little Flower Trio by LA Colors, um, the neutral. And uh, I like my neutrals. <laughs> I like my colors, don't get me wrong, but I do, I like a neutral. Um, that seems to be the one that hubby always is complimenting me on from from the time we were dating <laughs> and uh may god going on 16 years starting so uh i think it's pretty good judge i i i like him th th those colors um I'm trying to get this open <clears throat> but the off-white the cream color is, it looks like it's a matte. And the other two look shimmery. But uh, she had showed this. And uh, I fell in love with it. And 
I've never not been able to find it, never seen it till she showed it. And I'm not sure if she did a look with it or not, but well, she has turned me on to so many um palettes and I call these little, little things. It, it's a little three palette. Um, but the LA color ones, the, the, the 12 little ones that fit good in your purse and stuff. Boy, she's turned me on to those. I would have never thought to grab them. Um, but she, she had talked about them and, and talked them up very much. And I do, I like, I like them. Um, it's nice when you're older and, um, you learn about makeup again. Um, because I had gotten out of the habit of wearing it because the jobs, a couple of jobs that I had, um, in management, uh, one of them I couldn't wear it, and then when I managed Subway, I just, I sweated it off because those toaster ovens in such close proximity, I put it on and I just sweated off, and that was before I had found, you know, before I knew about primers and, and other things, you know, that you learn about after the fact um, that I found out about now this time around, so um, I just didn't wear it unless it was on a special occasion or, if he, you know, we went out or something, which was a rarity, you know, working 80 hours a week myself. So at that point in time, but, um, so this is all new for me, you know, primers, eyeshadow primers, um, face primers, this is all new this time around. So, but it's nice to learn things, um, from younger people that are finding it out for the first time because I am too in a sense again so it, it's neat and I just did uh, I admire the younger generation um, that can teach us older I hate to even think of myself as old but I'm I'm not young anymore but I'm not old old either but um, these are just so pretty and I do I really like a matte color I I like the shimmeries and, and, and the glitz and, and all that but there's something about a pretty matte too um they're really pretty but um here's the white the cream color here's the lighter color the brown it's too bad that they don't have names as far as the the colors of them should have had my shirt up There's all three of them. And then I went to Dollar Tree and, uh, sorry, <laughs> this is hurting me. Um, and I haven't bought any LA Color lipsticks and a lot of people have, that I'm subscribed to have talked about these. So actually seen three different colors from three different trips because I had worn the one and liked it which was the satin and I did like it so it's like a nudie color I had gotten these other two so they're very soft and they go on nice but I I've never seen these three colors ever at mine before, which, you know, I, I'm sure they've made them. I've just never seen them. And then, um, because I liked that one, that, you know, that has some shimmer in it. This one is um, Mauve Glaze. Um, now, this looks like a matte to me. I haven't worn this one yet. I just got this one yesterday. And that just goes on really smooth like that it's kind of a almost a, a skin mauve you know what I mean a it's a definitely a different color of a mauve but I still like it now this one is a shimmery this one is cocoa shimmer but we know how I like my browns so I just think that one's pretty. I don't know why I'm way over here. Um, I just think that one's pretty. Like I said, I've never seen these before. They are very pretty. And you know, for a dollar, like I said, can't go wrong for a dollar, but like I said, after trying that first one, I wore it um, all day um, the next day. 
and uh, getting a wet wipe here, <laughs> face wipe. <laughs> if I can I get three more things I wanted to swatch. Um, I ended up liking it, you know, and 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 I like my matte lipsticks because you, if I don't want them to be matte or just a little bit of a um, gloss to it, you know, nothing major, or I can't make it major. Um, I like the fact that uh, you can put some uh, lip gloss on it and stuff like that. Then also at the, no, I'm going to save that for last because that's a little review. And then um, these were all at my uh, drug mart. I've done hauls from there, a few things that I've gotten from there. These are all the um, Wet n Wild, the little tiny ones. Um, these first two were on clearance. Uh, Sugar 250B. I got it for 99 cents. Oh, I got all three of them for 99 cents. But this was on clearance. Don't know if that... Uh, I'm pretty sure everybody's had this one. I just, I've not gotten them yet. So I, I wanted to and it's very pretty. It doesn't have a lot of shimmer, I don't think, but you know, can't have too many whites, I don't think. I like white and black nail polish. It's right there. And this one was 252C Nutty. Like I said, I know everybody's probably had these, and I don't know if any of these have been discontinued or not. I'm sure they probably have. That's probably why they were on clearance. But um, I like the brown. And, uh, ooh, I really like that blended out. It's pretty. Ooh. I really like that one blended out. That is so pretty. And then um, this was out of the new um, line. Um, they had the Wild Shine lip. Excuse me. Some lipsticks, I'm assuming, but they were all sold out. Um, they had the um, Matte and a Super Shine. And a display. This is, and then they had, you know, the colored Wild Shine, and then they had the Mega Last polishes. I'm assuming they were. I'd never seen this at Drug Mart, and I'm there every few days picking up something or getting something because hubby wanted something or a piece of candy on the way home or or something. They must have just put them up, and they must have sold out. But uh, this is the Creme Brulee 251B. At least I've never seen it, you know, and I've been on the lookout for these because I want to get those both those palettes. The um, I really like the Walk in the Red Carpet and the one's got all the violets because violets, my, you know, purple is my other favorite color. But this one's a matte. I really like this one. It's a lighter matte. It almost looks like that one um, NYX color or NYX, NYX, NYX. I'm spelling it out. Um little nude um, nude oh, the little round one that I got it almost is similar to that just as far as the color I feel like I'm like way up here guys sorry <laughs> I'm just leaning because of my back <clears throat> right there it's really light I don't know if you can see it a little bit there but you could see it on my fingers so and uh, two more things and I'll be done here um, I was at Walmart Bully World <laughs> and uh, um, they my store doesn't have a certain spot for clearance products for nothing and I was around uh, the book aisle then it was the next aisle over and they had Duck Dynasty a bunch of stuff on clearance there and then this was there um, 
I don't know how other ones are, but mine is, they got rid of the one manager that was really good, and they got this other crappy manager in, and you can tell it. it, it the store's just gone to pot, and, and I'm being nice and not saying the cuss word in a hand basket. But this is called Creative Options. Um... They've got the sticker on it. But you can put your colored beads in stuff like that. Six tray beaded tower is what it is. Um, and and um, the only thing I could find, there was a, a spot here, right here, that um, it's glue. It's glue. It feels sticky, anyways. I think it'll come off. And then um, I like that the purple, that uh, pinkish purple color. And then here on the back, yeah, the camera's picking it up. Right here and right here. Right here. I felt something. Sorry. Um, other than that, on the outside. There's nothing on the inside, damage-wise, that I could find. I'm going to tell you the price in a minute, but I'm really proud of this. But you got your uh, one, two, three, four, five, six slots, and it even comes with these and all of them. Um, these remind you of the little mini nail thingies that, you know, only they're bigger. Um, I thought I got it for my nail stuff. Um, you know, um, I've like I said, I've already got these little trays, just the smaller versions, you know, um, that, that that you get that's already got stuff in them. Um, I can put other stuff in these nail stuff, obviously. Um, but I, I thought I for my nail stuff, I, you know, um, and can set on top, or I can take it and have it open if if I choose to. The original price was, you can see that, $19.97, okay. <laughs> I, I did a double take on this. I couldn't believe it, and I, I had to get it as we see it. It was $3. I, I thought this was a heck of a deal. I'm never that lucky. I never, never, never. I picked it up. I didn't even hesitate. I didn't, usually when it's something I'm not sure on price-wise, I'll ask Hubby. I'll call and say, hey, or text him and say, hey, this is what it is. I'll send a picture. You know, is it okay if I pick it up? Because it, in all reality, it, he makes the money right now. You know, disability hasn't kicked in yet. Um, stages is getting there. It's all but there. But, you know, so I don't. Otherwise, we, we would discuss it. You know, it's just how it is. It's always, it's always been, and I just feel guilty. He's not made me. Matter of fact, if he heard me say that, he would come in here and probably yell at me for saying that. But, you know, I just do. Um, but I thought it was a good deal. Like I said, I never am that lucky, and, and I thought that was, like, awesome. That made that hectic day at the doctor's. It was very pleasant to go back because I thought I did good, and that was yesterday, and I told hubby, and I showed him what I couldn't wait to show him when I got home, and he told me I did good, so... He thought that was okay that I got it and just cheat. Um, I got a little review. Um, it'll be in my empties also, but um, it's not running too long, so I'll go ahead and do it for you guys. Um, I haven't looked this up online, but um, I will before my next empties. Um, it's Dr. Brody's One Smile 30 Minute Teeth Whitening Strips. You get three complete sets in here. You get the top and bottom. It's like the crest whitening strips. It's from the Dollar Tree. Don't know. Like I said, sometimes the mine runs a little bit before or a little bit after everybody else's. Um, it says 30 minute express, noticeably whiter teeth in 30 minutes. Use anywhere, easy application. I've done I done three of these. I actually picked this up Sunday. I had to get a dozen of eggs. We went and Hubby's birthday was Sunday. Um, had gift cards we had to redeem, and 
got him his birthday present um, from Best Buy, and I said, well, I'll just stop into Dollar Tree and get some eggs. We went down makeup aisle, happened to be, and he's seen these. He said, well, let's give him a try. Oh, well, it work. Because he knows with me, what, with me, I happened to quit smoking, and um, I didn't think my teeth were that bad. The dentist said that they weren't, but boy, I, you can't, I should have done it before and after. I didn't think it would work because I've got that pen and, and that, I, you notice it with the pen. It's a good for a dollar. It really is. But this is like the bomb. I mean, you guys can get your hands on it. You should try it. Like I said, I, I didn't look it up online and I meant to, and I just realized that I didn't. Um, but I will, my empties, which I've got to do in the next few days too, I it's getting, it's not extremely full, but um, my candles are, I got a couple of, can, four candles in there, so it's making it fuller, so I probably should do them. Um, so I'll go and uh, look up some more information on this for you guys, um, or actually before tomorrow's video, I could probably, should do that then, and it wouldn't hurt to do it either. Um, but as soon as I can, I will find out, like I said, some more information on this for you guys, but it's... Yes, get, give it a shot. You're going to notice a difference. Um, this is from, you know, somebody that is a smoker. Um, two cigarettes a day some days, so some days it's five. But I'm I'm getting better. Um, yeah. So, Lord's help, um, I won't need them anymore. So, yes. But anyways, that's not here nor there. This is the video. This is part of the video, not not me complaining about quitting smoking, how I need to, and how I'm doing good some days. But I take it a day at a time with that. So, um, actually, I've only had one really bad day that I actually had five. The other days are usually just a few. So, my hardest part is is the, my main meal. That that's my hardest part is is after that. So. I gotta have that mindset and to where I don't want it. Um, I can push it and push it throughout the day, and I'm fine. You know, I'll find something else to do or or whatnot. But it's that after dinner one that bothers me. So if anybody has any um, advice on that, but if you have quit smoking, um, I'd be like to know that. Um, the cold turkey. How did you overcome that part of it? Um, but yeah, with this, um. Guys, give it a shot. Or if you have it, I'm curious to know your guys' opinion if, if you have tried it. But um, I will get off here, and I will be back tomorrow with another one. It's all nail polishes, and I will go in more in-depth, and I'll look up information for that for you. Like I meant to this time, because that was a bad, poor bad not to find that out, and I meant to, and I'm so sorry. I just scatterbrain sometimes right now. I think um, with my... Breathing's got me all consumed with there three days a week, and my whole days are consumed when I go, I feel like, because I'm there for four hours. But enough yipping. <laughs> That's not why you tuned in. Um, thank you so much for um, stopping by, and I hope I made you smile. Um, everybody have a good day, a good morning, a good night, and um, can they get... Any videos you might want to see. Um, sometimes I need some ideas other than what I've done. i um, got a lot of time on my hands at home. Um, not until it gets warmer can I do my little garden of figurines outside. So, And until we're completely done with the kerosene, I can't do the walls. So I really can't start the spring cleaning. So I'm kind of at a standstill at, at the moment you know because I'm not gonna start the laws while we're still doing the kerosene that just defeats the purpose so not that you can tell in this old house but I know it so Lord willing I won't have to do the fall and we'll be moved into a new place so be a lot easier on me but yeah I'm hurting in this position so I'm going to get off here I've yet too much the last of it but um Thank you all again for stopping by. I appreciate it. Um, as always, take care, and I will catch you on the flip side. Bye.